Okay. Bow. Yeah, man, we back here with another one. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. Low key, skip the intros. I've been wanting to watch this video, react to this video, because I seen it on my TL on Twitter, right? I don't know what the fuck it is, but I saw like a little bit of comments. I didn't, I didn't watch the video yet. I'm very interested in this. I'm very interested to see what's gonna happen, what he's gonna say, what's about that transpire, because I heard. Based off of people's titles, I, I see funny shit, and I just want to get right into it, because this is going to be very fucking interesting. Is this the Kai Senate guy? Oh, this is the Speed guy. Okay. I don't know who this dude There's is. Like I know who's streaming. There's a whole new legion of, like, black Zoomer streamers, and for as much as they sc talk about how, like, all white people did was scream at the camera, um, I feel like that's all these guys, too. I have, I don't know. Um, I don't know if they have more content, but holy shit. It's just not my sh but I'm probably just getting old. I, like, it's like the new... All right, you were getting old and you're getting racist. <clears throat> Let's talk about why. Wow. Oh, my God. He is. Because... He is getting older. That's that's such a... It's so easy to think, like, person. okay, Kai, Speed, but who else? Go, tell me who else is loud and black streamer. Who else? It's not Bruce, not Rage. None of them match their loud. I know, yeah. He's talking about the two biggest. He's yeah. making it seem like there's a fucking huge wave, a tsunami, an influx of. And the only identifiers he used was <clears throat> black Zoomer streamers that scream. So I always say people use categories and boxes to simplify life so that they can think about things easier. Because it's like humans are complicated and each one is so uniquely different that like to consider them all uniquely like is very challenging mm -hmm. Especially when you're trying to like make a generalization. Yeah. This generalization oh, is just okay. it doesn't exist. It's inaccurate There it's is an entire wave of new streamers from an entire community. They're not all black They're not all zoomers and they're not all loud But I think that's what he's trying to refer to in this very inaccurate generalization for sure incredibly inaccurate because I'm part of it I'm not Kai loud. I'm not a zoomer neither and again I'm even them being loud is not bad, bro Speed, I don't really got nothing against him. He's still a kid in my eyes. He just be doing some outlandish, egregious shit. But I feel like he has that target. He he targeted that audience, and now he has that audience. Eventually, he's going to grow out of it, bro. Just like every other stream or anybody else, you're going to grow up, and you're going to try other things. You're going to do other things. So I'm not really upset with him about it. It's just, it's not my crowd. I'm not old and no shit like that. I just, I see clips and shit, but I won't, like, you know what I'm saying? I don't go watch it. It's, I support him. You know what I'm saying? From far, it's just... It's not my cup of tea. It's, that, it's just that simple. I'm part of it. I'm not the biggest on fucking Twitch at all. But again, this but it's just this influx of right, just but black zoomers, zoomers loud, loud, screaming. Loud. Yeah, that's that's this yeah, is yeah, an influx of that. And that. and it's like you fail to recognize any nuance in the matter, which is a little disappointing because yes. I'm not as familiar to with make, Destiny's material. Again, neither. And to for you to make that 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 big assumption, you gotta kind of like back that, bro. That that that's kind of crazy, like. Not Connor, that's crazy. But isn't he one of them intellectual streamers that have that's conversations so, so and stuff like to that? To me, that was the biggest kind of downfall to this because I think the standard in which people hold Destiny to is one in which a bit more intelligent than just to make casual statements like this. It's out of his pocket. And more importantly, the reason why it's even more frustrating is because Destiny is a streamer himself. He's been a part of the community for years at this point. Yeah. Like he just sat there and said, he, um, he insinuated or highlighted how there used to be this perception of white streamers. So you would assume that somebody who's already been given that that blanket of, of generalization mm -hmm. would not then do if it he's to been another around, generation yeah. of streamers. If he's been around, then that means that he's been lumped in lumped in with any and all crazy shit, regardless if he did it or didn't do it, bro. That's just how YouTube and Twitch, like, for example, when, back in the day when you used to be considered like a YouTuber, you're a dweeb, a gamer, dweeb, like you was like kind of scrawny glasses wearing, and you could have been some going to the gym and just game and heart like you know what i'm saying like that phase and optic and all these those two people changed really the narrative of gamers and then it literally birthed into a whole nother genre of shit like streaming and in and, and a lifestyle vlogs and all these other things so but yeah shit like that is 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 <laughs> it's, it's weird to do it you, you had it done to you and then you do it to somebody else bro and it's it's just it's, when does this shit end? It's a continuous cycle, bro.
Unfortunately. Even 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 if it is accurate or not. And so for him to do that, that that and like even if we want to say this is the most and the most optimistic lens possible, okay. you would still would not want to see somebody who went through similar generalizations and characteristics Dude, that aren't ass. accurate to then do it, just do it to another subsection of streamers. Like that that right there is just mad dumb, especially coming from somebody who is as intelligent as Destiny. Because for people out there who don't know, Destiny's a, a streamer, does a lot of um not just chatting, but he does a lot of debates. That's really what he's known oh, for. Okay. He gets on has a subject matter debates it so he was talking about um something we actually talked about earlier this week which was the um whole i speed situation uh -huh. and i one of his takeaways were just the the end the wave just black it's just, it's just, ah, loud, loud ah. zoomers Oof. that's that was that was Yikes. his takeaway which is a very very you know what the crazy part about that is that wave he's referring to was largely started and amplified by Aiden Ross. This nigga, he's a yeah. white Jew. He is white and he is Jewish. He's not yeah. black and he's not loud and he's technically a Zoomer. So he doesn't fit one, two of the three qualifications that you made up. So you failing to recognize the diversity upon the community you're speaking on is fucking stupid. And it's even beyond dumb. You would think he was like on some, like a television pundit or something. That's, that's, that, that's what he, he used sound to be like. on Twitch. He's, he, he literally, Destiny literally sounds like a 47 year old who's hosting a TV show right now. That, that's literally what Destiny sounds like. Bruh. And, and yeah, so it's like, it it's like you're trying to cast these negative stereotypes on a community and it's not accurate. And everyone part of the community is looking at you like, Man, what are you talking about? Yeah, that's very weird. So he's apparently an intellectual streamer, or to a certain degree at least. Uh, let's see what else he got to say real quick, because I don't really want to judge too much. Let's see what... Literally for the second half of the year, Kai was literally pushing for the proper recognition that he deserved. Let this be a message, bro. Yo, Twitch, and I know Stats is going to see this. It's no way. This is going to go everywhere, bro, Twitch. There's no reason why there is nobody. There's nobody on the front page of your platform, bro. Okay, y'all know the other side of the platform that our community can reach and y'all preventing it from happening, bro. Y'all preventing from other viewers to seeing what we got to offer. Even when he was breaking so many yeah, records in the process of doing so, inevitably became the number one streamer on the platform. Still. And still, when still. it came to the streaming Through awards, the he spelled his name incorrect which in and of itself is crazy. Yeah, it is. And, and along the way, still discredited, like for various reasons. Now, to be fair, I don't think that Destiny falls under that umbrella of people because- people That was crazy too, bro. That's crazy. It's, and, it's, and it's to a certain degree, it's because, not to a certain, it's like they do that because they feel as though you're not, not necessarily profitable, but you're not, like they don't, you're not marketable. Like, Kai should have been on the front page of Twitch multiple times. Easily, bro. Easily, he's broken numerous fucking records, bro. And still going, bro. Like, easily, bro. And that's, that's fucked up because they know what that would do for Twitch, bro. Like, that would have, they would have people like, that look like Kai or come from where Kai look like. I've said this before. And I'll say it again, they, they would have people that look like Kai or come from similar situations like Kai doing Twitch. And we could have somebody to go even further than Kai has and break bounds beyond what we've ever seen before. And it only takes like that a simple like, hey, look, look at the, the top streamer on Twitch. He look just like, you know what I'm saying, me, like you or me type shit. You know what I'm saying, African-American or, you know what I'm saying, something like that. And it's crazy that... I don't know. I won't necessarily say Twitch doesn't see that because I think they do. I think they. I think a lot of these conglomerates they understand like, yo, if we put if we put like somebody like Kai or somebody like Agent or somebody like you know not maybe not Speed because Speed, Speed is he be saying some egregious shit, but somebody like you know what I'm saying an African American uh, streamer or YouTuber like on a like just on the front page or just. You know what I'm saying? It it'll do something to to other people who maybe think like, oh, I can't do this, or like, ah, nah, nah, I gotta go this right. I gotta do school. I gotta do this. I gotta be in the street. You know what I'm saying? Like it'll bring them in, bro, and then they tell them like, yo, I could do this. Just that simple look. I'm telling you, that shit can literally spark something so great, bro. You see, like you said, there's a wave coming of of black content creators on Twitch, on YouTube, and it's not just Zoomers or or. or yelling people it's a it's a whole different genre different different people from different backgrounds 
they're they're discussing different things, they're doing different things, you know what I'm saying? They're they're different content creators, bro. So that's just that's just fucked up, man. I hate uh, hopefully eventually they do do something about that though. Regardless, the problem though is that like what Destiny just did is that for whatever reason there is this cascade of like mm -hmm. generalization that's being thrown on people. And when it comes to Kai, like, out of all streamers, I can I can like confidently claim rooms. he is one of the most, if not the most, in my opinion, creative English speaking um, streamers right now on the platform. That's a fact. So when people just like put him in this box. This box up, man, the nigga oh, does he's just, everything. He's a just chat. He does all he everything. Does is yelling, screaming. He's just this black what? zoomer. It's like it's it's missing the essence of who Kai the nigga, is. To Kai touches on every single thing, bro. Everything, bro. If you watch Kai, you know that, bro. He does everything, bro. I don't know how the hell he does it, bro. This nigga is mad. Like he's been doing content creating for a minute, so he he has a little bit of experience with it, bro. But he took. He came to Twitch and took turned that shit up, bro. I'm passionate about it because I know, like, hey, 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 hey. I'm passionate about it because I know the, the the simplicity and the importance of what he's doing, bro. Like, imagine ten years ago we had somebody like like casting that on a fucking YouTube or Twitter like front page or like on a Reddit post or like an article. Like what, bro? Do y'all know how many, how lit it would have been back then, bro? It would have been so many more people trying to be trying to do this shit. It'd Era crazy, of streamers bro. were competing with the old ones, or like the guys that were more established and known. Because when when they were large but not competing with, like when they weren't in categories for awards, when they weren't competing for like who has the most concurrent viewers or who has the most subs on Twitch, it wasn't an issue. But the second it is now, like all of a sudden, money laundering, fucking rumors start That's arising, right, and it's like. You coming up with any reason to not want to give credit yeah. to somebody and it's weird. That's the weird part, Destiny. Yeah, after no, after Destiny has said some choice words, a bunch of other people responded. Um, your age, somebody else who's part of the WL community, he responded. Where did that come from? Chat, where I literally explained how it's annoying to me, how like you know, like if there's a white streamer that I like or a content creator and they say some like, you know, some edgy shit, some shit that might come off as racist to my chat, because they don't understand like the way he talks and shit. So now I gotta like explain how it might be like, yo, so I like this, this, that, and now I'm looking like a raccoon without the RA to my community. Mm -hmm. It's like, a, it's just, it's just annoying. I just said it was annoying. You feel me? It's just fucking annoying. Cause now like the the WL community, the black people are like, yo, what are you, are you defending? What you is no, I'm just trying to explain, explain like yeah. what he, I just said it was annoying, my nigga. What the fuck is wrong with this nigga? I didn't get called a nigga racist or nothing, my boy. PTSD, because niggas are calling him racist all damn day, right? So we, I, I I guess I said like trigger words or some shit. Like, what the fuck? Why do you get so tight? My nigga, I don't want you to bow down. Like, what? After that, Kai himself also responded. You feel me? When I'm energetic like this, because this might be seen as, as screaming. Like, what am I doing right now? Might be seen as... That's what I'm saying. As... And, and, that's, and it, it, it comes off like sun screaming, but this just, again, people that are like Kai or come from what Kai come from, this is regular active. This is not nothing outlandish. If you come from that shit, you know what screaming and yelling and cr doing crazy shit look like. And I'm telling you, this is not it. Kai just got... In niggas just have energy, bro. That's it, bro. And they express it sometimes maybe in a little explosive way or on a non-subtle way. But that's that doesn't mean like... Come on, bro. As like I'm screaming a lot and I'm doing too much. And it's it got too much energy. Niggas from New well, York! The niggas from New York! Come on, bro. Come on, Do you know son. that the way I act and my energy would also bounce back to the viewers? That too. Damn. You think this you want to see me sit here like, hey, guys. This is entertainment, bro. Oh, man. And a few other people as well. Um, uh, terminology and, and um, phrases like um, Destiny's Rosses got thrown around and stuff like that. And people just felt like they, they um, were a bit upset. And Destiny, he had a, he had a couple of choice words when he wanted to clap back a couple people, you know what I'm saying? The WL community, like, playing the race card, like, all the time. Like, I get it, you're black, and that's tragic, I guess. But what I just, the I don't fuck? Care it's, it's boring as fuck <laughs> to me. Um, honest to God, like some of the exploding like black online communities have been like some of the most homophobic places I've been to like openly like I feel like I'm back in white communities from 2012. Um, I love that like the transphobia is just like rampant and nobody cares transformers lol. Um, like for me to jump in here and for them to be like you're racist I'm like the f out of here with that bull. Like it's so it feels so beneath me to even like jump into that. Sh I just super don't give a f 
and whether I, I just super don't give a fuck. You know what's a weird? You know why this is also a bad take? Because you're the guy who fucking brought race into. I'm it. about to say, <laughs> nope, like, nobody would actually even said it if. Yeah, that's, hey, that's, I ain't gonna lie. Nah, this thing is lost, bro. What the fuck? You brought up black streamers, bro. <laughs> niggas was not worried about you. Niggas was not thinking about you. None of that, bro. You brought yeah. But this is this is this is. Hey man. Hey man. This is what goes on, bro. This is what I've been seeing on Twitch, bro. Well, I've been seeing about Twitch. Don't know them, right? Let's say, hypothetically speaking, you genuinely don't know them. Even then, if you don't know them, why would you then follow up with some stereotype? Like, you, like, or a stereotype that's based off of their race. That's, that's what's crazy. Mm -hmm. And then, you claim that you don't watch it, you claim that you don't know them, but then you triple down by making some other arguments about the community that you claim that you don't know about. The WL community, like, playing the race card, like, all the time. Like, I get it, you're black, and that's tragic, I guess. That was crazy. I just I that, don't care that, that much. That was it's, it's boring. crazy. Um, honest to God, like, some of the exploding, like, black online communities have been, like, some of the most homophobic places I've been to, like, openly. Like, I feel like I'm back in white communities from 2012. Very intellectual taste you can expect. If you're gonna compare me saying there's, like, a kind of, like, a trend, at least on Twitch, of, like, the black, like, screaming content, or whatever for the Kaiser the iceberg, which by the way there might not be. Maybe those are just the only clips I see on LSF. But yeah. if you're gonna say that's the same as me going up to some Asian person and be like, oh Cody Chiwa, Cody Chiwa, oh 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 Cody Chiwa, you're actually retarded. Like go deep throat some BBC somewhere, swallow, go guzzle some black dudes come because that makes you feel really good about yourself as a progressive. Like go knock yourself out, but leave me out of your boot licking virtue signaling cuck ass bull. Go find some black putt panther to <laughs> give it to you up the ass or something. I don't need to be involved in. Yeah, that. I don't know Please. what's up with this nigga, bro. I really don't want, I really, again, this is clips. I don't want to do what he just did and see, like, watch little clips and, and make a, a generalization off him, bro. But honestly, bro, his whole attitude towards the situation and him even, the fact that he sparked the argument, a, a conversation in the very first place, and this has been his response, bro. Honestly, I don't really, I ain't going to say I don't give a fuck about the dude because I don't even, I don't know him to begin with, but, bro, this is weird, bro. This is very weird. And again, like they said, until up until Diggy started getting awards and, and numbers and everything started to, to float around and shit like that, and this conversation probably would have never happened, bro. Like, like let's be for real, bro. So he could just be. I feel like he could just be tight for whatever reason. Maybe he's seeing more more content creators who he may feel as though are not as creative, or or because they do this and he doesn't like. Maybe he just feels as though they shouldn't get certain shit. But this is weird, bro. I just think this thing is a weirdo. To be honest, it's not really much to say about him. I don't know if he races or no shit like that, but the, the attitude, I can see how it kind of comes off like that. This thing, he's a dickhead, bro. Think he's a dickhead, and he's some, he one of them old, hating ass dickheads, bro. <laughs> like, that's the take I got away from this shit. I don't, I haven't seen enough of his content to know if he races, bro. It's a weird, weird dickhead looking nigga, bro, who just says anything, edgy, funny, try to be funny type shit. I ain't really, niggas not jacking this. But worry, man. Shout out to all the little black streamers upcoming. Me included, and content creators, and, and whoever else want to do this shit, man, you can do this shit. I don't care where you come from. I don't care what you did before this. You can easily do this. You see Kai's doing it. You see all these other people on this platform, not only just Twitch, YouTube, TikTok, all these other places that are making it happen, bro. You can do it, bro. Fuck what he's talking about. Whichever route you want to take, if you want to scream in this motherfucking mic, break your desk, do whatever. Do whatever makes you fucking happy, bro. Don't let nobody stop you from doing that shit. Nobody gives a fuck what he thinks. Nobody gives a fuck what anybody else thinks. If you love it and it's doing something for your peace and, and, and for the people you love, do that shit. Fuck this dude. Simple as that. But, yo, check me out for another YouTube video, man. Uh, I'm probably going to drop a couple more, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Share this shit with your friends, yo. More content coming soon, man. Grr, bow.